So President William Ruto in the Finance Bill 2024-2025 attempted to increase the price of bread and other basic commodities. A very wrong move. Any a student of political history and science will tell you uh, that bread has single-handedly contributed to some of the bloodiest revolutions and the fall of some of the greatest leaders in human history. Let me take you back to the year 1789. A leader by the name King Louis XIV was ruling France and uh, during his reign there was a significant increase in the prices of bread. When the queen was approached or uh, confronted with the matter, she asked a derogatory question. Why should the people eat bread? Why can they eat cake? That led to five years of uh, bloody war in France and uh, the fall of King Louis XIV. In the year 2011, there was significant increase of bread prices in most Arab countries and um, in an attempt to reduce the demonstrations that was going on in the streets, some of the leaders introduced subsidies on the bread prices. But but these subsidies came way too late. Tunisia, Libya, Egypt, Yemen are some of the countries that saw their leaders go home because of the increase in bread prices. In the year 2018, the Republic of Sudan, there was an increase in bread prices. Uh, the government of Omar al-Bashir increased the prices of this basic commodity from uh, 25 Kenyan shillings to uh, 77 Kenyan shillings. That is almost thrice uh, the price. This led to months of demonstration and the eventual fall of uh, the government of uh, Omar al-Bashir. Those are some of the countries amongst many others that have seen revolutions that have been uh, gaslit by the price of uh, bread. So it is clear for any government the easiest path to go home is to touch the price of bread.